Alright, that boy Gucci third leg had gone on Angel's stream and he had to defend himself. Don't his name sound like he's a captain of a pirate ship? Gucci third leg. No Diddy. Pause. Like his name sound like he's a captain of a pirate ship. Captain Gucci. Captain third leg. No Diddy. But let's see what he did. Look what she said right here. Now nah, look what she said. Now nah, look what she said. Nah, then she said this. <laughs> nah. Uh, what? Nah, that boy really pulled up the receipts. He had her up and ready. <laughs> so, Pop, what are you positive for? What is that? Now, nah, so he did have it. He do got it. HSV1 positive. Can you read that? It says, you're, it says you're positive for HSV1. Now, nah, why he shaking so much? Nah, nah, my boy nervous. Nah, Mr. Third Leg, pause, pause. He nervous, though. Yes. Boy, nervous. So what is that? Can she you explain said, what that means? So positive for HSV1 means you do not have herpes. It means you have had probably like a cool sore, more so um, stuff like this. And this is very common in the whole world. Right. You do have it though. Like, cause like, it's like a sore though on your, your mouth. Two or three people in the world have HSV1. Trying to gaslight? <laughs> He trying to gaslight. Let me look at. Let me just. He said two other people. Nah. Just looked it up so I can. The greatest, most adult stars they do not test for HSV one. In in the situation, I understand she is a victim. Wait, let me see. Star. What he just say? People in the world have HSV one. Let me look. Nah, he's trying to say most people got it. He's trying to say everybody got it. Nah, he trying to gaslight. Nah. Well, like when did he become a um? A doctor when he uh, become a doctor how he know this did he do like some research now nah, let me see something but like, can't he still um spread that he still spread that though in this situation <laughs> i understand she is a victim but i'm sorry danae davis is not my victim um no nah, he nah he said she's not my victim also to kind of back backtrack on everything me and me and danae filmed on february 10th when we filmed on February 10th, Danae did not show me a, a new test. She did not show me a previous test. She never even showed me a test. I was wrong as a content creator for even working with her. But just knowing how 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 desperate she sounded, how eager she was, she said she needed the money to make for her, you know what I'm saying, like for her, her rent. She said she... Now, that boy got the dates and everything. That boy got everything under the fence, so I think he guilty or not. I think he's guilty. Nah, uh, this how bro be showing the text messages from his lady right here. Me. He look a little nervous. I don't know. He might be guilty. I'm not gonna lie. He look a little nervous in this video. <laughs> nah, it's like he's shaking. Why is he shaking? The victim. He says she's not my victim. He says she's not my victim. Um, even with the whole content situation, like porn, OnlyFans content, I'm done with everything oh so you're a well he was finna retire now no, that's kind of crazy like if he wasn't like if he was innocent why would he be like retire if he already been doing this retiring as a porn star you're done retiring. gucci's third leg is retired i'm done with everything i thought he like he was one of the top dogs or something because for one it's like man like when i first got into content like i was doing it you know saying like just for you know saying like um for the money of course and you know saying like just for the um, for the excitement, it brought me at work. But just knowing how much situations... How for the excitement? I mean, well, like, I'm not... <laughs> nah, why he was looking so scared when he was trying to pull up the own um, results and stuff? Why he was looking so scared? He all shaking and quivering and stuff. Sorry. <laughs> I'm pulling up my results right now. Nah. Okay, boom. Mm. All right. Uh, recently, there's a whole <laughs> saga. There's a woman claiming that she contracted herpes from Gucci. Um, what's your thoughts on that? And what's your experience with him? Um, my thoughts on what's going on right now is I'm actually still trying to see exactly what is real and what is not real i'm i'm with everybody else on this um, um as far as my experience with gucci um 
it's been nothing but, I mean, we haven't ever had an issue. I've never caught anything from Gucci. Um, the first time his test results were 72 hours too old for my liking. So we shot with a condom. The first time I shot with him in February, it was no head, full condom scene. Mm. That's just that. So Extra the second time I shot with him in July, we had mm -hmm. full test results. <clears throat> um, we shot seven scenes that day. It was seven scenes. Nah, seven scenes is crazy. It's like what? Nah, seven scenes, ten rounds each. Nah, seven scenes in the wild. Like, how is somebody capable of that? You gotta be superhuman. Like, now you gotta be superhuman. <laughs> hey, no diddy. You gotta be like superhuman to shoot seven scenes in a day. Like, bruh. Do they not get tired or depleted? Like, they just really just be going crazy. Like, that's like a whole day. It was like, Damn. I was there for like, I think we were there in Houston for like 19 hours together, and then I went right back home. And it was no problems. He uh, edits the content. He sends the content. Like a normal person, just two rounds. As far as a coworker in this, he's he's been nothing but ten out of ten. Hey, uh, uh, wait, hold on. Act. Do you see her? I'm sorry. Nice to meet you. Um, I'm Aiden. Do you do you have a camera that you can display or no? I do not want to be on camera currently because I wasn't really prepared to be on camera tonight. Gotcha. No, okay. Yeah, no, 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 like literally, this is my first time even like even like telling her about the stream because when she found out about the situation, a lot to me. I was getting death threats, hate comments. She was the only one of the only people to call me, kind of just like telling me, okay, like Gucci, like you know, what I'm saying you could come out about your truth, you know, what I'm saying you could let everybody know, you know, what I'm saying and she hey, kind of pretty much encouraged me to kind of like speak up because I was just. That boy brought a ring light. Hey, Gucci, so she, she mentioned that the first time you guys shot, your your tests weren't up to date for her liking. It, yeah. it, it, is, is that normal for you where, you know, you, you might uh, you might be about to film a scene with a woman, but maybe your, your test results isn't that current? Because, again, you know, we're at this stage of, How often and, you guys and this is where I also bring chat? her back into it. The, the thing about this herpes thing is that it's not always easily detected via test. I think on the regular standard panel that most people have these tests done on. Yeah, not even, yeah it's not even put, put on that. It's detected via a, a direct blood test, but even then it has false positives. So sometimes even your primary uh, um, care physician will be like, uh, like, unless you're having symptoms, they won't necessarily go out of their way and test for it. So it, it, Right. So I was, I was asking her. Oh my god! It seems like she was she was confident that you didn't have an outbreak, but I'm wondering how confident is she that she knows for a fact that you don't have the virus at all? Okay, so is that is that a question for me? So so so, so, like, so, so, so it's really for her. How confident? Yeah, yeah I'm gonna say it. Um, how confident am I that he does not have the virus at all? I don't know because I would have to see his current test results. Which I mean, clearly, we're all waiting for. The world is waiting for these test results. Right. Which, what tomorrow, time? What? Gucci, Gucci. What time tomorrow will you have the results? I want to say afternoon, only because I know mornings. You know, what I'm saying like kind of usually backtrack. I, I used to get, I used to get my results like two p.m., three p.m. And by the way, Gucci, like, 2 so in, the, in the porn community, uh, they, they use, like, the same testing facility, right? Are you using that, uh, that same testing facility or are you using a private, private one where you have to? Because I think when, when they use this one, go ahead. There's three common um, places that a lot of people go. Um, and it's in our guilty chat. Get tested. Um, my guilty. most familiar place is going to be Empower Testing. Um, it's a black-owned in Atlanta, I go to talent testing, uh, usually when I'm in Miami, or let's say like LA, cause I know it, it comes back quicker. Then when I'm just like, you know what I'm saying, back home, I go to my regular doctor. So so, so the one that wait, you're waiting for tomorrow, script? because I believe- <laughs> Nah, wait, is that what a, wait. Nah, that would be a little crazy, he had a script, nah. told me that the talent testing <laughs> one actually 
he populates that other people could see it. Is he? That's within the industry. Are, are you going to no, that think, one or no, Empower, as you said, or are you going to your own private physician? My own private. My own private. So, so if you're going to your own private physician, private? it's then upon you. Like, how can we verify? Because, again, your your, your private physician can't. Nice. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. definitely. Uh, how will we be able to verify? I believe I just have to pull up on my phone. Honestly, you can't fake the truth on the phone, you know. And, I mean, you can't fake the truth on the phone. I mean, it's pretty easy. Pretty easy, my guy. The truth is right there. Really, really okay. quick. I have a question for you, bro. Um, so I want to know the first thing. Obviously, like, let's just say you are. I'm gonna. It's a two part question. Let's say tomorrow comes yeah. and your results are all negative. Um, what? How are you gonna take action? Are you gonna counter sue? Are you going to, like, I need to know what you're gonna do because it, it. You know, it does. I understand where you're kind of coming from. You want to be done with this industry completely. But what is your exact first move as soon as you get caught innocent? And then I don't want to put this out there, but I'm just curious. What if you get caught being positive? You know, it's, it's just something that I got to ask. I mean, right. he is not coming out with a positive test. Is it positive if he's not going to show it or he's just going to like get a get a fake test or something? If he come back positive, he's not showing it on stream. I'm not going to lie. Definitely. So just like you said, there's always two, two sides to the story. When I will be pro proven negative, I 100% want to quit only fans, content, all that. I literally just want to stick to acting, um, pick up some more hobbies, pick up some more careers, actor. probably like some music, acting, entertainment. But uh, when did he become an actor? Um, my main goal right now will be to push safe sex. So I actually, it's it's funny. I've actually already been working on the condom brand, and as well too, I have launched what <laughs> hashtag or wrap it up NFT. You know what I'm saying? And Earth. Which nah, this guy's a freak. A condom NFT, wrap it up. Nah, this guy's a freak. Nah, three thousand bodies and a con wrap it. Nah, he was not wrapping it up. I will be um donating ten thousand in profits um to sexual awareness companies. Hey, hey. Uh, we're trying to become a philanthropist. Philanthropist. I can't pronounce that word right now. I will be um, donating oh, shoot. Mm. ten thousand in profit sexual awareness companies. Hey, hey, hey um, j j just to clarify, because, because you did say you're going to your private um, physician. If the industry what? as a whole, yo, Aiden, it's not, it's not a laughing matter, brother. Like, you know, well, we're serious. The thing well, that no, well, well, I'm not laughing at. No, I'm not laughing at. Really? Now you want to be serious? Now you want to be Don't serious? Do that. No, this is Aiden. Act, don't do that shit, bro. I laughed at the part where you said oh, yeah, No, no, no. I'm laughing at the part where you <laughs> It's about an end. Can you guys let me finish? Funny? Holy shit, bro. Shit ain't funny. It's not funny. <laughs> bro, it's, it's not funny. It's not funny. funny. It's not this funny. Not but you're making funny. you're making it's an NFT. Nah, why he getting pressed? Why he getting so nah? Why he getting so bad? You laughing at his um condom EFT NFT. You're making an NFT out of a condom, bro. How can I not laugh at that? You're making an NFT out of a condom. You're making an NFT out of a condom, bro. You're not taking it seriously. You're making an NFT. You're trying to profit off of this whole thing. You're making an NFT out of a... See, you're laughing. You know it's a joke, bro. Wait, wait, hold on. Bro. I didn't want to ask this because <laughs> condoms doesn't necessarily prevent herpes trans um, transmission. Now my boy really tried to defend his, his defend his life, and they over here laughing. <laughs> and they over here laughing. My boy tried to defend his life, and they over here laughing. My boy tried really I tried to defend his. My boy got the receipts and everything. First, you said there was an open cut. Number one, and, and, and you know, I do think this is awakening for everything that's happening in the OnlyFans community. <laughs> It's just not as regulated as as like the porn industry, which is primarily based in LA. Wait, chat that. Do you think it was dick? safe for you to have sex oh. with somebody with a with the open cut on your penis, bro? Thing about it is, <laughs> no, knowing. Oh nah, nah. Academics got to chill. The situation she was in, I literally told her, 
she literally said she needed four videos. Like she literally said, I like my, my, my what you, told her? Her. you told her, yo, my penis. I, I, I literally look, look, I literally said, I have a cut on my room. I mean, I have a cut on my penis. Oh now. my God. Now, I, hold on. I'm going to be honest though. Uh, I'm just trying to get some details right, you know what I mean? Cause you know, shout out to my boy Aiden, but you know, Aiden trying to get a platform to talk. We just gotta get to the truth. She said you told her that you cut yourself shaving, but hair don't grow on your dick. That shit was crazy. <laughs> hair, nah, hair, 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 hair. I ain't gonna lie. Yo, I, 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 no, 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 it grows no, no, no. on my dick. I'll show hey. y'all right now. No. Hey, yo, pause. What are they talking about? No homo. No, look, no I'm, homo. No, I, 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 like I'll show you. Like, act, don't like, leave. I'm just. Sorry, but you, uh, you're, you're gonna have some hair. It dude. does. I, I can vouch. Hair grows on my dick. Nah, why are they so like? Nah, why are they so like? Now, why are they so determined to get this point across? Look at them. Look at them. Look how determined they are to get this point across. Nah. It grows on my dick. Thank you. Thank I'm you, about bro. Nah. They really bonding over this right here. Nah. Hey, oh, pa. No, diddy. I had to say all three of them. It does. It grows on my dick. Yo, 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 yo. yo. Oh, we, we yo. Sit here. Bro. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Right, nah, don't show it. Whoa, yo, yo. Nah, was he fit to whip it out? Nah. He was just about to whip it. Nah. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Nah. He was fit to look what die. I can't even say that. <laughs> I was just finna say something. But he was fit to whip what. I, yeah, I can't even say that. His nickname out. Pause. <laughs> don't show it. Please yeah. don't show it. Please. <laughs> oh my god. So you're telling me. Now, why is he that determined? He was really finna just get up and. Nah. And you're shaving. You're shaving up your shot. <laughs> yes, I gotta shave everything. Nah, I, I will vouch. Hair grows on my penis too. And, then I, I'm gonna keep it real. AK, I don't know if you noticed, but if you shave, it grows like two inches, bro. Like no funny. It's like, remember? Well, hold on. What he giving him tips and nah? He giving him tips. Yeah, you gotta shave it. Nah. I'm talking about on the shaft. Like, yes. we're not talking about a pubic hair. Act. What? My life it grows on my shaft. I swear my life it does. On my dick it does. Oh, that's different. That's different. I never put a razor nowhere near my shaft. I got his name tatted four days into knowing him. And I know everybody's like, wow. whoa, what the fuck? Now that's kind of crazy. Four days? Nah, he must have been. Nah, he must be a player in honor. Was the dick uh, that good? Like, I, I know, I know, obviously it's, it's like, <laughs> sour grapes at this point, but still. <laughs> was just big bro act you're not <laughs> no way he just said was it that good now nah, he said would it be that good nah nah oh, act, I you're a grown ass pause. man and asking if another <laughs> dick is good that nah, looked like he was intrigued about nah pause nah, academics gotta chill what <laughs> nah why did he ask that he said, was it that good? Why do he want to do that? Why he want to do it? Nah. Why he want to do that? It was just big. <laughs> Bro, Ak, you're a, hold on, Ak, you're a grown ass man asking if another dick is good. I got his name tatted four days into knowing him, and I know everybody. Oh, nah. Why he. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> nah, that's probably. This is... <laughs> so, I'm Nah, that's probably the craziest statement this whole out of this whole thing. That's probably the craziest statement. He said, "Was it be that good?" Nah, that's probably the craziest statement. Dang, what's wrong with my internet? Ah, oh. your what do you believe is the it, you know obviously she's still a victim. Um, she showed that she has it. So what do you believe is what happened to her? What do you think? You think it was somebody else who gave it to her? Do you, what, what, can you explain what do you think that happened to her? I'm going to be very 100% honest. And as a man, we all know, even as consecrators, yes, we, you know what I'm saying? We, we might have, you know. Nah, he look a little zesty trying to explain himself. He look a little zesty right here. I'm saying like, had some sexual relations done with work, but it's like, after work, what happens? We meet other regular people. We, you know, saying have other regular sex, which is uncommon for, which is undocumented. This girl has been on many countless of shows, been with many countless of men. I can't even name them. But it's like 
I'm sorry, but it's like you're backtracking into one dude that you didn't even show no test results. Right, right. And I showed you too my proof. And also too, I'm waiting tomorrow. As soon as my results come, the whole world will see. Everybody will see. Hundred percent. We could do it. All right. I'll be waiting for the test results. All right. Uh, I know this is kind of a personal question, but I'm curious. And the reason why I'm curious, it's a two two pointer. How many bodies did you have before you caught? And then how many do you have after? And I just want to see where you're at with your sex life. Since everybody thinks I'm already nasty, bitch, I don't give a fuck about telling my my body count. So Gucci was 44. Okay. Um, I am. I think she's 19 too. I mean, no, I think she's 20 now. Now at 58. 58. So. During the time, and listen, 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 listen. <laughs> After Gucci, right? Before I found out that I had herpes, I wild the fuck out. Is that a little crazy? 58. Uh, I know this is kind of a person. Wait, did she just say, wait, let me see. What the rest of this clip? During the time, and listen, 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 listen. <laughs> After Gucci, right? Before I found out that I had herpes, I wild the fuck out. Whoa. All right, so Gucci, I'm not going to say the other part of his name. He said, like, he don't know where she got it from. She was just hopping around. And this is her, she said. I don't know what she said. She said how he gave it to her or something. Um, show. And there I broadcasted my personality. Um, I made a name for myself through what we did on the stream and everything like that. And can I clear up this speculation real quick about Deshae? Um, So me and Deshae did have sex protected while we were on his show in November of 2023. I contracted HSV2 February 10th, 2024. I did not know that I had it until late March. I cannot give you the exact date yet. I have to go to Piedmont Urgent Care and get that exact date so I can have that exact receipt for you, right? Yeah. The last time me and him had vaginal sex was November of 2023 so he you, does not have hsv you said vaginal sex did you did you guys later on have oral sex yes okay and when, when did you guys have oral sex june so the, the shade in the clear okay a few months but ago only oral, okay only oral. hey man so again there's gonna be a lot of sex education um that, that's kind of have to be given to like the mass audience who just don't know this is a lot of taboo okay. stuff so you said you contracted it from from your knowledge in February. How do you, how could you prove or how would you be able to prove when you contracted it? Because from my understanding of that virus is that someone may have it for a unlimited amount of time, but might only know once they have an outbreak. So how did you know that you contracted at that time as opposed to maybe you had it all along and the symptoms presented itself at that time that you then went to the urgent care and got tested. Okay. So with collaborating with Gucci, Gucci was the first person I've ever seen an active lesion on or a lesion ever in my life. Nah, nah. What if he was like, I just a pimple right there, just a little scratch, you know? I was just like trimming up the other day, you know, and it's like, you know, and I, and I got a little nick right there. Nah. Actual partner that I've engaged with. A friend of mine, whenever I was in high school, contracted HSV, and I saw her lesions, but it looked nothing like his. It was brand new. It was not a healed sore or nothing. He was the first person I've ever had sex with that I saw something like that with. Not only that, a few days, um, my first time that I ever experienced any kind of irritant was five days after I first had sex with Gucci. On February 15th, I thought that I split open my vagina because whenever we were having sex, I couldn't finish because it hurt so bad. I literally thought that I was, I split it open. It started bleeding and everything. I was so dry whenever everything happened. It, it literally was so confusing to me. And by then I had already asked him what it was on his penis. No, I did not ask him the first time we had sex, what it was on him, but it was his job as a person who knows. And I don't care what you say, Gucci, like respectfully, you know that you lie. You have went over 
brand yourself in circles on the stream all night. I need. Can we go through that portion because he said you were aware of the open sore or cutter lesion. He said he had told you that, and you had said, I watched some of your videos. You said that he had told you that he nicked himself while shaving his shaft. And he came on the stream to say, after that, because you have filmed five scenes and you could confirm and deny any of these things I'm saying, but I'm just stating what he said. He said, maybe while you were giving him fellatio, your teeth worsened the open <laughs> cut that made it appear like that on the last video. What's your response to all that? Nah, her teeth is a little like. My response. Now nah, she do got some big teeth. She probably did nick him a little bit. My response is that he did not say anything about his lesion or his his sore whenever we first engaged in sexual contact. She got teeth like on um, like Ti son. Nah, she really got them chompers on her, like this right here. She got the chompers. Nah. He might have cost a little. I don't know. At all. Um, it wasn't at all. It wasn't until February fourteenth. Did you notice? Laying in bed. Did you notice it? Huh? Did you notice? I did. Yes, I did see it. My thought process whenever I was coming into it was this was my first collab, professional collab, professional collab. The collaborations that I had prior were all romantic partners that I were com okay. was comfortable enough to have sex with on camera. He was the first person that I ever had sex with that I did not know prior. And not only that, he was somebody that I was watching online and that I was fantasizing over for the longest. So whenever Whoa. I got there, I, I, I assumed that it was a safe space. Did you, did, what, what did you, sorry, what did you think it was? It, you know, cause you, you know, you did see it. So what did you think that it was? I honestly, whenever I was going into it, I really didn't think much of it. It wasn't. So what's crazy is, is the reason what made me ask is because I, I don't know if I can show the videos anymore. Right. But it changed what it was. The first day that I met him turned into three different things, you know? I didn't know what it was, what that was on his dick. At first, it was just. So she saw a mystery bump on. Nah, she saw a mystery bump on his own, on his thing, and she still went for it. Nah. Nah, she should have known. She seen a little mystery bump. It's not acne. She knew it was an acne. Just one little circle, and you can see in the pictures that I sh I posted. In that black outfit, you could see that the lesion. Wait, did he say it looked like a razor bump or something? Looked like one little scab. If you scroll over with me in the pink dress, that was the day, February 14th, the day that I asked. You can see that the le lesion turned into three separate. I should know the Pacific dates. I should know all like all this information and stuff. Placements. Am, I, am, if... Is that a... Is that an owl? I have to it, 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 just asking for clarification. So it, when I was listening to him and maybe I don't know if Aiden got a different, uh, um, you know, conception of what he was saying. So this he said, yeah, I filmed several times. I thought it was the same day. You're saying this was over several days. Yes, I how many days? I filmed with Gucci. the first day we filmed three sets, three sets. So it was the one that went mega viral with the tan and blue blue um, outfit. And then we filmed the black set with the black and the fishnets. And then we filmed an, uh, another set in the same B&B with red. Oh, this was the ice. This was the um, fake ice spice. Um, no, nah, I know who she is. I see, this was the fake ice spice girl. We filmed this was like the Dollar Tree ice spice. Three sets that day. That day he invited me to fly out to Houston and spend the week with him. And I agreed. Mm, okay. I packed up my bags. Mm. I packed up my Airbnb. And I literally flew out there. And there we filmed two sets, three actually. Three one sets. was one in the red set. Another one was while I had a pink dress on, and the other one was a threesome while we were drunk. Hmm. And 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 it was in Houston that you said, "Hey, I, your penis looked like this the first night, but now it's it. it you're noticing some difference. That's that's what you're saying, right?" That's not exactly what I said. No, okay, that's okay. not how it went. I literally, whenever I was laying there, I noticed because over time I noticed that he was like messing with himself. Right. I noticed that he would like put his hand down there. I it, it, now I know he was itching it. 
So he was and itching he was, it. You saw him itch it. You saw him start to itch it. I, I saw him put ah. his hand down there and fix himself. And uh, now I know that that's a discreet way to scratch your herpes sore. Got so uh, I asked him, I was like, hey, what is that on your dick? I didn't say, oh, it changed over time. No, I just said, what is that on your dick? He said, oh, I cut myself while shaving. He said, oh, that's crazy. But Aiden, I completely believe you whenever you say that you have get hair on your dick. I, I do. have an ex that had hair on his dick. So whenever yes. I heard that, I was like, no, I've met a man that had hair on his dick before. And it, I know it's very rare because I do, I've had sexual partners, numerous sexual partners in the past. There's only one man that I came in contact with that had that, but it's still possible. And you guys can get a doctor to come on here and talk about it. it it's That's real. why. Really? Hmm. Didn't know that. Why would you suck a D with an after open cut? 